let's go to the business of the day. Today, we'll be looking at a very interesting topic known as painting. Um, number one, painting involves the application or spreading of colors on a surface such as paper, canvas, surface of a wall, etc. Um, another definition of color, sorry, another definition of painting involves painting involves the use of oil, watercolor, gouache, and ink on a flat surface such as paper, board, canvas, or on the wall, on the surface of the wall. Now the third definition, painting could be described as the application of color in a work of art. Now, how do we know what our painting is? We'll move further to talk about forms or category of painting. Now, we have two categories or two forms of painting, which is the monochromatic kind of painting and the polychromatic kind of painting. Now quickly, I'll tell you what monochromatic painting is. Monochromatic painting involves the use of a single color to paint a drawing or to paint or to apply on an artwork. Then polychromatic painting involves the use of more than one color or multiple colors to paint an artwork or to paint on paint on paint a drawing. Now we go further to talk about types of painting. Now number one here we have landscape painting, number two imaginative painting, number three still life painting, four nature painting, and number five abstract painting, number six, figure painting. Now, I would have explained these types of painting to you now, but time will not permit us to do that. Now, let's uh, talk about the materials and tools for painting. Number one here, we have cardboard paper. You either use cardboard paper or canvas on a board. Then number two, pencil or charcoal. Now number three, we have oil, gouache. Gouache is also a, a pigment. It's a color you use in painting. Then we have watercolor. Then artist paint brush, set of brush. Then drawing board, your easel, your palette, and your palette knife. Okay, now I'm uh, giving to you the materials uh, you can use for painting. Now I will have us to do the practical uh, aspect of painting. I'll explain to you what painting is, the categories of painting, the types of painting, and I've listed the materials for painting. Now I would like us to carry out the practical aspect of painting.